Hello everyone, and welcome to Dr. Carmenati's YouTube channel. I'm so excited to have you here today as we dive into a topic that's as mysterious as it is fascinating. What is quantum entanglement? This subject sits at the heart of quantum mechanics, and I can't wait to explore its wonders with you. Suppose you love unraveling the secrets of the universe. In that case, I'd love to hear from you. Drop your thoughts in the comments, suggest ideas for future videos, give this video a like, and hit that subscribe button to join our curious community. Let's embark on this mind-bending journey together and uncover the magic of quantum entanglement. To understand quantum entanglement, we first need to grasp the strange world of quantum mechanics. Quantum mechanics studies the tiniest pieces of reality, particles like electrons, photons, and atoms. Unlike the everyday world, where things follow predictable rules, quantum mechanics reveals a realm of uncertainty and odd behavior. Particles can act like waves, exist in multiple states simultaneously, and change just by observation. These quirks challenge everything we think we know about reality, and entanglement is one of the strangest of them all. Let's start with a key idea. Particles have properties like spin, position, or polarization. In the classical world, a spinning top is either spinning clockwise or counterclockwise. You can measure it and know for sure. In the quantum world, a particle's spin can be clockwise and counterclockwise simultaneously, a state called superposition. When you measure the particle, it chooses one state, but until then, it exists in a blend of possibilities. This sets the stage for entanglement, where particles become so deeply connected that they defy the rules of space and time. Now, let's dive into the star of the show, quantum entanglement. Imagine two particles that share a special bond, like twins who always know what the other is feeling, no matter how far apart they are. When two particles entangle, their states link together to tie their fates. If you measure one particle's property like its spin, the other particle's property instantly adjusts to match or complement it, even if they're light years apart. This connection happens faster than light, which baffled even the greatest minds like Albert Einstein. Einstein, physicists Boris Podolsky, and Nathan Rosen first highlighted this phenomenon in 1935. They argued that quantum mechanics seemed incomplete because entanglement suggested spooky action at a distance. Einstein didn't like the idea that particles could influence each other instantly, breaking the speed of light limit. He thought there must be hidden variables, secret instructions, that predetermined the particles' states. But in 1964, physicist John Bell devised a way to test this idea with his famous Bell's theorem. Experiments since then, including a landmark one in 2015, confirmed that entanglement is real. No hidden variables, just pure quantum weirdness. Let's make this concrete with an example. Picture two entangled photons, tiny particles of light created in a lab. One photon goes to New York, the other to Tokyo. If a scientist in New York measures her photon's polarization, say it's vertical, the photon in Tokyo instantly becomes vertical too. If the New York photon turns out horizontal, the Tokyo photon flips to horizontal. This happens immediately, faster than any signal could travel between them. The photons behave as a single system, even across vast distances. You might wonder, how do we even make particles entangle? Scientists use clever techniques to create this phenomenon. One standard method involves a process called spontaneous parametric down conversion. Here's how it works. A laser fires a photon at a special crystal, which splits the photon into two lower energy photons. Because they come from the same source, these two photons share properties like polarization and become entangled. Researchers can then send these photons to different locations and study their behavior. Another method uses atoms or ions. 
Scientists trap atoms in a vacuum, cool them to near absolute zero, and use lasers to entangle their states. This approach powers quantum computers, where entangled particles, called qubits, perform calculations far faster than regular computers. Creating entanglement isn't easy. It requires precise control and isolation from the environment, since any interference can break the delicate connection. Entanglement isn't just a cool party trick. It's a cornerstone of modern science and technology. Let's explore some of its most exciting applications, starting with quantum communication. Imagine sending a message that's impossible to hack. Entanglement makes this possible through a method called quantum key distribution, QKD. Two parties share entangled particles to create a secret key, a code to encrypt their messages. If a hacker tries to intercept the particles, the entanglement breaks and the parties know someone's eavesdropping. In 2017, China used QKD to send secure messages over 200 kilometers via satellite, proving its real-world potential. Next, consider quantum computing. Unlike regular computers, which use bits, zeros, or ones, quantum computers use qubits that can simultaneously be zero, one, or both, thanks to superposition. Entanglement links qubits together, letting them solve problems like cracking codes or simulating molecules that would take classical computers millions of years. Companies like Google and IBM are racing to build quantum computers, and entanglement is their secret weapon. Entanglement also plays a role in quantum teleportation. This doesn't mean beaming people across space. Instead, it means transferring a particle's state from one place to another. Scientists entangle two particles measure one alongside a third particle, and use the results to recreate the third particle's state elsewhere. In 2020, researchers teleported a qubit state across 44 kilometers, a step toward a quantum internet that could connect quantum devices worldwide. Finally, entanglement helps us probe the universe itself. Astronomers use entangled particles to test gravity, search for dark matter, and even study black holes. Some theories suggest entanglement might explain the fabric of space-time, linking the quantum world to Einstein's relativity. This idea called quantum gravity could unlock the deepest secrets of reality. Despite its promise, entanglement comes with challenges. Entangled particles are fragile. Any interaction with the environment like a stray photon or vibration, can break their connection, a process called decoherence. Scientists work in ultra-cold, isolated labs to stabilize entanglement, but scaling this up for practical use, like a quantum internet, remains a hurdle. Entanglement also raises profound questions. Why do particles act as one system across vast distances? Does entanglement mean the universe is fundamentally interconnected? Some physicists, like David Bohm, propose that reality operates on a deeper level we can't yet see, where entanglement reflects a hidden unity. Others, like those exploring the holographic principle, suggest entanglement might encode the universe like a cosmic hologram. These ideas push us to rethink everything we know, and I encourage you to dig deeper into these mysteries. Quantum entanglement isn't just for physicists, it's for anyone who loves a good puzzle. This phenomenon challenges our understanding of reality, opens doors to revolutionary tech, and invites us to ask big questions. If you're curious, dive into books like The Quantum World by Kenneth Ford, or watch lectures on quantum computing. Follow experiments like those at the Perimeter Institute or explore online courses on quantum mechanics. The more you learn, the more you'll see how entanglement shapes our future, from secure communication to unraveling the cosmos. Let your curiosity lead the way. What a journey we've had. We've explored quantum entanglement, from its spooky origins to its incredible applications in communication 
computing, and beyond. This phenomenon shows us how deeply connected the universe is, and I hope it inspires you to keep exploring. What do you think? Does entanglement blow your mind, or do you want to learn more? Share your thoughts in the comments. I read everyone. Suggest topics for our next video, give us a like, and subscribe to stay curious with me. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you soon.